Hey everybody, Failure to Report here. So I recently picked up a Rift, and the first thing I thought was, okay, I need to boot up War Thunder. Obviously that's going to be an incredible experience. Uh, if there's anything that's going to make me puke all over my keyboard, it's going to be War Thunder. And the air battle mode was incredible. Uh, the first thing I did was fly uh, over the Pearl Harbor and like the test flight stuff, and that was just a, such a cool experience because I was stationed in Schofield, so it's like, it was... <laughs> All the nostalgia. And then I boot up the tank battles, and I just want to fucking scream right now. Because, as you can see here, <laughs> the fucking VR is not attached to the turret. It's attached to your tank hull. So if I'm facing one direction with the tank, and I traverse the turret, I have to literally move my face to look in the direction that the turret's traversed to. So if you go up to, like, 90 degree traverse, you're literally, like, your chin is on your shoulder in order to see that direction it's incredibly discomforting and it just doesn't work well at all like if you're in a position where you're trying to hide behind an object and you're driving forward taking off a shot and then reversing backwards you would literally have to have your head turned to the side in order to do it but wait there's more and it gets better because okay let me let me go ahead and demo this really quick um if you go to look down sights and you're traversed 90 degrees or more, and, you know, your head was, you know, with your chin on your shoulder, and you go into the sights, you have to immediately snap your head forward again, because then all of a sudden it centers your view. And if you turn your sights off and you want to see, like, okay, where's my target or anything like that, uh, 90 degrees to your side again, you have to immediately snap your head over to the side again. And it's just, like, it's so jarring and so poorly fucking done that I literally, <laughs> I'm just, like, left blown away that Gaijin would bother implementing VR and then de just do such a fucking terrible job with it. I'm just completely shocked that anybody would do this. It's so poorly done, which is shocking because the with the aircraft and the flying, it's so well done. And then you go into ground battle and it's just such a shit show. Uh, it's really disappointing. I guess I just don't understand because it's such a common sense thing. Um, I feel like even even my 12-year-old son would know that that's, it's just terribly done. Preston, yes. it's terribly done, right? Yes. You could do a better job, right? Yeah. Don't you think it's stupid that you have to look over your shoulder in order to see where you're looking? Yes. It's just ridiculous. Um, so if I'm missing something in the settings because I've scoured Google and I've gone through this actual in-game options like a million times please somebody let me know because it's literally stopping me from playing this game right now uh which sucks because it was one of the ones that i was really looking forward to doing in vr and uh it's just such a poor experience right now